Hello everyone, how's it going? Dr. Incompetent here, and let's play some Ruin Arc, shall we? Well, my buddy Space Cookie got this game for the channel a while ago, and I played it, and I enjoyed it. But I wasn't really sure necessarily what I was doing, and I understood that the game is evolving. It's, you know, still coming on in its development. And I've seen that, you know, since I had played, they released a big update, update 11, which was, is called Grudges, and I thought, um, it's been a while since I played, so let's play the game again and see what the new content has added. Now, um, I can continue our progress, and then maybe I'll do that, but I don't know if all of the changes will be applied to the game that we had or not. It's an incompatible save. Um, and so what we're going to do then, never mind, is we're going to delete it, and we're going to start a new game. And um, our victory condition, they added more victory conditions where it's like, you can eliminate everyone, or... Uh, just play Sandbox, or try to summon the Ruin Arc. I'm still going to go with just trying to summon um, the Ruin Arc. And... Uh, we can be a different faction. We could be humans, elves, vampires, lichens, random. I'm going to go random. Um, oh, and that's who we're against, I suppose. Uh, so we're going to call this incompetence, the faction that we're fighting against. And so we're going to be basically fighting against ourselves. Now, map size is for one village and one faction. And I think eventually, you know... I will change that, but let's go ahead and just start the default setting, which is one village that we're fighting against on a small map, just to, you know, further understand the game. And we're going to go continue and do this. Now, I don't know if this will bake in the tutorial to the game or not, but I actually kind of hope so. Okay, pick a tile to place your portal. I'm going to pause the game, and fantastic. Um, actually, yeah, I'm going to pause it. And I'm going to, let's see, look around on the map. So, obviously, it's different than what we had fought before. And but this doesn't, maybe, I don't think this. these are humans, but I'm not sure. Uh, there's earthen wisps all over on this map. Let's look around here. There's trolls. And uh, these are maybe elves. They live in trees or something. And then what's down here? What is this? I don't know what this structure is. Maybe it's like an old structure. There's moonwalkers down here. Michael Jackson's moonwalker. A hilarious arcade game. All right. So, gosh. Where do I want to put my portal? I kind of like the idea of just, you know, beachside. Yeah, if you're a demon and you're coming back, beachfront property seems pretty good. I have no idea, by the way, but also it seems like it's a desert, so people wouldn't go there. So let's hide our place, like, in the desert. Yeah, sure, build it there. All right, we have a deadly portal. Configure loadout. Okay, so... Um, let's see what we are. Uh, we want to choose our archetype. Uh, do we want to be the Puppet Master, the Lich, or the Ravager? Alright, um, so I think... Let's see. Last time we did Ravager just to fight people. Um, why don't we be a, a Lich? I mean, you know, it's, it's pretty amusing. Let's try to use our Dark... Necromantic powers to terrify the world of the living. Why not, right? Narcolepsy. Um, we just make people fall asleep. That's so funny. It's not even like that bad. It's just like, eh, you fall asleep. Raise dead, much worse. Demons, envy demon. It's a melee physical combatant with a poison attack. It's effective in knocking out opponents. Okay, and we can make a crypt to spawn skeletons and a prison to capture villagers which we can torture, brainwash, or drain to produce chaos orbs and freezing traps, narcolepsy, raised dead. Yeah, let's do this. 
I'm ready. I'm ready to go. Alright, the key to winning the game is knowing how to produce chaos orbs in the early game. Try using various traps and damaging spells. As you upgrade your portal, learn which powers can provide chaos orbs by going through their tooltip descriptions. I'm ready. Okay, I still have the game paused, by the way. Uh, so, I could corrupt a tile for two chaos orbs, but that seems uh, just excessive. I could use my freezing trap or my monster spawner. Um, I, let's, let's go ahead and build a, a crypt, I guess. Um, and let's build it right next to our base. Why not? And, um, do I want to build a prison right away? I don't know. I'll summon my envy demon, I suppose. And then, it's, okay, we're fighting the elves. And I can reveal their info, but let's not do that. Oh, okay, time management, yes, yes, yes. We could change the game speed, target menu by right-clicking on a character or object. Okay, so I'm just going to unpause it and see what happens. So we made this thing, and I think there's a demon circle there, so I don't know if it's making a, you know, skeleton for us or how that happens. Uh, there's a demon circle. Okay, anyway. Um, let's see over here. Let's see what's going on with these elves. Alright, so here's an elf over here. I'm going to pause it, just see what we've got. Um, this elf is idly sitting. Now, I understand that this might be twisted. Okay, so I apologize. And if you'd like me to change it, just let me know. Okay? Um, but... I'm going to start naming these elves after channel members and patrons and friends of the channel, even though that these are people that we're going to be terrorizing, all in the good spirit of just hilarity. Okay, so um, Space Cookie is the honorary first elf, and he already said that he's cool with being in the game. So, I'm going to put people in the game, and if you don't want to be a victim of uh, our lich and the terror of our lich, just let me know. After I've already done it. There's no escape. Okay, so um, let's go with some others. V for victory. There you go. Confirm. And... Where are you at down here? There's a person hiding there. There we go. You're trying to hide, huh? All right, hella. There you are. And let's see. Who else do we have around here? Uh-huh. I see you in there. All right, crab. You're in. You're idly sitting. And let's see who else we got over here. Uh... Let me click on glad or non. That's funny. Um, okay. All right. Wee bit. You're in. And let me click on this other person. All right. And let's just keep doing this. Mass pups, you're in. And then, okay. Uh, oh, boy. We've got another one over here, huh? I don't think so. All right. Manto, you're in. All right, do we have everybody? <laughs> okay, there we go. Uh, now we're in. Now, let's see, what do we want to do? We want to upgrade our portal. Gather enough spirit energy by producing chaos orbs and then spend them to upgrade your portal to unlock new powers. You win the game if you upgrade to level eight. All right, so in this context, um, let's just terrorize some of these people. So, you know, I could right click them and I could afflict them with a negative trait, I guess. Uh, or I could, can I just, yeah, let's get you narc, I'm going to make you narcoleptic. And boom, I'm just going to inflict everybody with narcolepsy. Uh, no, I don't want to spend all my mana. Let's just see what happens. So we have one narcoleptic. 
And we got a hundred of this mana. Build more mana pits to expend maximum mana capacity and hourly replenish. So we, every hour we get a hundred. So that's pretty good, actually. Build a prison to snatch villagers. You have access to a prison. You can brainwash prisoners to turn them into cultists or torture them to afflict them with a random flaw. To build one, um, push two. Okay, cool. Yeah, let's do that. Um, I'm just going to build it here. I have no idea, like, where I should be building stuff, but, you know, it expands the creep. Now, how do I capture prisoners? Can you go capture somebody? What do you do? You're going into the wilderness. No, no, no. Can you, like... Can I click on this person, for example? Snatched villager. Yeah. Um. Oh, okay. We'll select a snatch party. Here's the prison snatch party. So we're going to select our leader, which is... Oh, we don't have any charges. We have to get charges. Okay. I don't know how to even do that. And I also don't know how to make skeletons. Does it just automatically make a skeleton every once in a while? How do you get charges? Alright, the NV Demon. We can rename this after a channel member as well. Okay, yeah, so this is Chara. In. Skeleton now available. Okay, so we made a skeleton. Um, after a certain amount of time... Or where is the skeleton? It just said skeleton now available. But I don't see where it is. Is this a skeleton? That's a spawning pit. Well, anyway. Um, let me see about your charges, Char. What's going on here? Info. Um, their role is a snatcher. They're good at knocking out targets, which is what we want to do. Right, so let me just go into the tutorial in Chaotic Energy. Right. Um. Abilities. Uh huh. Okay, well let's try this again. I can queue up this ability, right? So I can just say like, go snatch. Um, you know, wee bit, for example, right? And I could be like, hey, snatched a villager, and we could select a, a leader. There's insufficient charges, but um, we can we could put a skeleton on the job. Uh, how do you get charges? Get a charge. Um. Hmm. Okay. Well, you know what? While we don't have any charges, let's just make people narcoleptic. Oh, we gotta wait for that. Okay, never mind. Narcolepsy, we gotta wait. Okay. So we'll just wait while things are happening. Maybe the charges just happen over time. Um, I can upgrade this. It's level one. Breeze dead. And for ten, I can upgrade it to level two. But I don't have ten. I have one. So that's not good. I need more. Um, release powers. No, 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 no. We don't need to do that. All right. Um, we have a crypt. We have a prison. Oh, we can make a... Uh, oh, we can make a freezing trap that has one charge. All right, well, let's just put a freezing trap down to start bothering these people. And where are... Sure. Let's put it, like, right outside their door. And we can use a monster spawner over here by Manto. And let's just see what happens. I'm going to unpause it. And there's a water nymph, and... It is... I don't know what it's doing, but... We're getting stuff generated, because... We were... It'll spawn a monster. 
Oh, there's the, the monster. But the monster is, like, running away. It's going to the berry garden. I don't know if that was what I was hoping for. But anyway. Uh, let me just see in the, in the tutorials about charges. Uh, do, do, do spirit energy. Right, right, right. That's mana. The Maraud allows you to summon minions to raid villages. Uh huh. Uh huh. Okay. Alright, that's fine. We'll just keep we'll just keep letting the game go to see if we can get some charges with this with our our demon. Okay, and then in the meantime also Let's see, we're generating actually a lot of spirit energy, so let's go ahead and just do a spell. Now those are all... Oh! Narcolepsy charge, freezing charge, replenished. So then, let me see, can I capture Wee Bit yet? No, they just don't have a charge. I don't know how to give them a charge. So we're not going to have a leader. Can I just send a skeleton? Let's wait till tomorrow until we have two skeletons, I suppose. Um... We have no intel. Alright. It's fine. I'm just going to let the game go. Let the game go. And apply an affliction. You can apply an affliction to a villager. Right. I did do this, but maybe you're saying that my charge has come back. So, Massa Pups. Um, oh, they're blessed. And a space cookie, I think I already made you narcoleptic. Um, hmm. All right. Anyway, I'll go l let you uh, let you sleep. I don't know how you got blessed, but I don't like it. Oh, space cookie is attacking the monster spawner. That's not ideal. All right. Um. Info. Yeah, they're already narcoleptic. And I can't hit Massapups, the druid, because they're blessed, I believe. So they, they're they immune to my power. So our, our little spawner is not going to make it. It's a shame. I can accept that. There's a troll. I don't know what we do with, like, a troll. I wish I could unleash them on the enemy. That would be hilarious. We'll figure out how, though. All right. So I'm going to uh, speed it up a little bit. Just wait for the next day. Our energy is filling up. Put a freezing trap right outside their door. Constantly funny. Okay. And let me slow it down now. Alright, so... Uh, let's see. Manto, let me afflict you with narcolepsy. And let me pick up these chaos orbs. Great. We have enough chaos orbs now to upgrade... Um, our portal, which is fantastic. And then, can I finally snatch Wee Bit? I really want to snatch him. No. Um. Okay. No. I'm going to add two skeletons, I guess, and just try it. Oh, you do have to have a leader. All right, well, then never mind. Okay, so maybe time will give us a charge on that. I don't know, but we did apply an affliction. 
I tried to. Uh-huh. Alright. And let's see. Just kind of... Put a, put a trap down, maybe? Anyway, while we're doing that, let's just upgrade our portal. Yeah. Yes. Spend it. Maybe I should unsummon them. Maybe I shouldn't have summoned them. Maybe that was my mistake. Maybe they need to be unsummoned, and then, like, while they're hidden, I can summon them out. So let me try this. Crab's having a party. Manto's going to chop wood. Victory's doing their thing. Um, freezing trap replenished. Okay, look, they're charging up. Okay, so the problem was, that was my own fault. The problem was that they don't get charges while they're deployed. Okay, so I didn't understand that. Now I get it. All right. So hopefully we're making skeletons. We're charging. We're doing stuff. Spells. Freezing trap. Let's just put this in an annoying place. Yep. Wee bit absorbed a power crystal. All elves gain poison resistance. I don't like that at all. Crab is upset. They found someone freezing. They're they're fixing them. They've become agitated. Their retaliation though is still zero out of five. Crab is fixing things up. Oh, okay. We we leveled up. We can upgrade powers. We can spawn a Necronomicon. This spell will create a Necronomicon on the target ground. If an appropriate character picks it up, it will turn into a necromancer. A necromancer produces a chaos orb each time it raises a skeleton. That sounds really good, actually. I like it. It also produces two skeletons whenever it or any of its skeletons do something at an ice blast. Okay, cool. Let's just summon a Necronomicon, like, over here, and see if anybody's interested in it. Anybody want to pick up my cool book and become a necromancer? Maybe I shouldn't have summoned it there. Maybe I should, should look for, like, more appropriate, like, water nymph or something like that. I don't know. Um. Oh, okay. Tier 1 non-lich option. Choose from one of three powers from the other archetypes tree. Oh, okay. Um, I can get Splash Water, Trigger Flaw, or Kleptomania. Um, let's get Kleptomania. I like that. And then I can also do Summon Skeleton, Poison, or Seize Object. I could take their resources... Yeah, let's try to take their stuff. It just seems funny. Okay, great. All right, so um, let's see if anybody... Oh, is anybody going to pick up that book? You can. All right. Um, Crab, why don't you become a kleptomaniac? And then um, I'm going to ice blast. There's two people in here. So it just seems wise to just hit them uh, with the blast. Okay. Good. They don't like that, that I did that. Which is not a, you know, not surprising. Okay. So now I'm going to uh, go ahead and plan a, an attack. A kidnapping. 
on wee bit. Oh, almost got the charges. Okay. So Massive Pups is attacking the spawner. The freezing trap is not getting activated. So I'm going to Ice Blast Massive Pups. Get out of here. Massive Pups has to run away. Uh, because Mass Pups was surprised by that. Mass Pups is now coming back and causing me all kinds of problems. My poor monster spawner. It's never going to work like this. All right. Uh, Mass Pups, can I afflict you? No, you're blessed. Space Cookie, can I afflict you? No, we're waiting. Victory, can I afflict you? Oh, yeah. Narcolepsy. You just became narcoleptic. Everyone in this village is like, we fall asleep so often. What's going on here? It's me. It's the demon watching you. All right. Let's see. All right. Well, you can take your small little victory. Fine, fine, fine. And... Okay. Uh, let's see. Oh, 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 Hella... Hella took the Necronomicon. Look, she's going to go... Um, it says right here. Let's see if I can find it. She's going to go to the Mage Tower. So maybe she's going to go learn how to become a Necromancer. Oh my god, that would be awesome. Alright, Space Cookie. Now, you've already been afflicted. Massa Pups. Can we snatch the Villager yet? Yes. And we're going for you. Alright, do it. I don't know. Yeah, summon the party. Here they come. Can Let's see if we can get mass pups out of here. Let's see what happens. Uh-oh. This isn't going well. There's too many people in here. All right, so I'm going to pause it. My demon is getting beat up. So I'm going to instead... Um, drop this down and damage them with that. And then I'm even going to put, like, a freezing trap right there. All right. Um, due to my recent actions, demon worship has become a heinous crime and incompetence. <laughs> Aw, there's nothing heinous about demon worship. It's it's fine. All right. Um, did we kill somebody or did we knock them out? Oh, Weebit has died. Oh, God. Weebit, I'm sorry. The skeleton killed Weebit. Now, can I raise dead on this? Let me see about this. Raise dead, yes. You're in. We're raising Weebit. Weebit's back. Weebit is back. What are you doing now? You're going to the wilderness? All right, so the, the capture attempt failed. We killed everybody. It didn't work like I wanted, so I'm going to have to, like, weaken people or something. I don't know. <laughs> So I tried to capture somebody. We killed them, but we raised them from the dead. Can we level this up? What's it going to take? 20? Oh, yeah. Do it. Level me up. Fantastic. All right. We leveled up. And... Oh, no, no, no. Wait. Looks like... Wait a minute. Never mind. Massa Pups. We did. We did get... We killed Wee Bit, but Massa Pups is getting dragged to the prison. Look at the skeleton's little action right here. It's just like... A blue stick figure with a box. That's what you is being used to represent a skeleton dragging a person off to a demonic prison. Well, we've really euphemized that one. All right. Um, and Envy's coming back with the wee bit skeleton. That's great. Good work, everybody. All right. So let's see. Can we do anything else? Oh, we could build a spire. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Build a spire. Of course. That looks good. All right. So, the Wicked Snatch Party has disbanded. Indeed. And let's see. What do we want to do with the prisoner? We have to wait. Um, all right. Let me right-click, and we can create blackmail... This produces an intel regarding the state of a player's prisoner. It may be used as blackmail material when shared with acquaintances. I can torture to give him a negative trait. 
but I can't brainwash them because they're blessed, and I can't drain their spirit because they're blessed. Um, uh, blackmail seems funny. Let's blackmail him. Let's see what intel we got. Okay, so we got some intel, I guess? What else can we do? And we can torture him. Alright. I apologize. We're giving you a negative trait. They've been bandaged. My god. Alright, let's see what happens. Let's just unpause it. And then I guess we should let him go. So they can spread the joy of what happened. Now, let's see. Did Hella come back? I'm not seeing that. Where is Hella? Yeah, I don't have enough info. I gotta spend some resources maybe on the info for that. Alright, so... Let's go ahead and do some spells. And... I can always put down a freezing trap. This is a funny thing to do. Oh, narcolepsy. They fell asleep. Hilarious. Uh, let's see. Let's just put this right in front of your house. Oh, they're going to go disarm it. No way. How dare you break apart my trap. Oh, an ant is in combat. What? I don't know how that happened. Did I do that? Torture charge replenished. Um, God. I mean, can you imagine a torture charge has been replenished? I don't even know what to say about that. Uh, all right. Monsters, reserves. Okay, we have skeletons. Good. What's going on over here? Mass Pups is still in prison. Um... Did, it, did we give you a negative trait, I guess, would be the question. Uh, let's see. Let me reveal the info. Traits. So, eh, they're deathly afraid of lycanthropes. Is that all we did? That's bogus. You're getting tortured again. You didn't get a negative trait. We don't have any werewolves. All right. Let's go. Let's see how this is going. This is a tough fight. Oh, V for victory. Barely won. A power crystal, huh? Let me seize this object. I took that from you, and I'm going to put it... Ah. Uh. I'm going to put it in the woods. I'm going to put it way over here. You have no power crystals now. Oh, they fell asleep. Hilarious. Okay, great. Narcolepsy for the win. Actually, speaking of n narcolepsy, let me see. Space Cookie, you've now become a kleptomaniac. We're ripping this village apart one villager at a time. It's pretty brutal. Okay, uh, so we leveled up and we gained some powers. Mana Pit, Primordial Pool, Bio Lab, and a Terrifying Howl. Awesome. So the Mana Pit increases our mana and regeneration. We want that. This lets us upgrade monsters. This allows the player to afflict villagers with a customizable plague. Hilarious. And this makes releases a bunch of screaming skulls that's right that's what we're here for their spine tingling wails will cause all not nearby characters to flee great that's what we're looking that's what we it's all about okay um all right yep okay perfect Alright, I'm going to summon an another Necronomicon over here. I'm just going to, you know, uh, leave it over here by Manto's area. And then... 
just, you know, place a hilarious uh, freezing trap by this person's house. And then, um, nah, I think Victory's got everything. Manto, uh, we're waiting on Klepto to recharge. All right, I think we should let this person out of jail. Let me see what, um, they're bored <laughs> and they're spooked. They're bored. They're in jail. That's hilarious. They're like, God, this is so boring. Um, but... I thought that torturing gave a negative trait. That's it? They did? We're gonna have to torture again. We're just not getting powerful enough negative traits. At least that I've seen. There's a tarantula. Go, tarantula. Get him. Oh, we have more powers to unlock. That's right. I keep forgetting. Okay, so uh, we can make people a music hater or we can make them fear fire. Hating music is hilarious. And then we can make a blizzard, we can poison, or we can seize monsters. Uh, let's poison. I do like splashing poison around. All right, awesome. Okay, let's see what's going on here. Freezing trap has replenished. Fell asleep. Alright, let's see what they do when they encounter the tarantula. But in the meantime, actually, I can afflict... No, I don't have any... Oh, there are... Space Cookie's a music lover, so I can't make him hate music. That's so funny. Um, I'm gonna make Crab narcoleptic. And then, let's see. Alright, um... Okay. Oh, okay, they're fighting. Perfect. Alright, let's go ahead and drop down uh, some poison right there. And then, I'm gonna Terrifying Howl on Victory. Okay. Uh, what is this? Oh, they got a migration. So they have people coming to their village. This is awesome. Just, I love how they're like, yep, yeah, we're here to settle in the village. We love this place. Uh, we have a little bit of a problem with, uh, you know, bad guys. But other than that, it's great around here. I'm just tormenting these people as much as possible. There's really no reason to do it, but it's funny. Wait, there's every reason to do it. It gives us all the charges that we need. They're dismantling the trap. Gosh, what? It's no fun. You're not supposed to do that. Um, all right, I can't do that. I can't do any of that. All right, all right. Now, where's the new people? They're down here sleeping. Welcome. I'm so glad that you're here. <laughs> That's poison. Oh, they're still sleeping in it. They just stay asleep. In the poison, apparently. Why not? I guess if you're comfortable. Alright, we're getting a good amount of stuff here. Let's see. Now, do we want to upgrade powers? We can upgrade narcolepsy, which makes it trigger more and makes him sleep longer. That's funny. May pickpocket other villagers. <laughs> Gets angry when music is playing. God, these are so funny. It's so passive-aggressive. Yes. Let's make them pickpocket other villagers. <laughs> Let's make them turn on each other. God, it's so insidious. Look at this. Space Cookie's playing music. So if we made somebody a music hater, they would hear that and be driven into a rage. Perfect. All right. So I've got some shrubs and 
<laughs> we collected some more spirit energy, which is fantastic. These people are going to... They're building a little village down here. Oh, interesting. Okay. So I thought they were going to go join this village, but they're just moving into this area in general. That's fantastic. All right. And um, Hella is down here at the Mage Tower, and I don't know what is going on, but we gave her a Necronomicon, and I love it. So this game is just hilarious, everybody. I uh, We started a new one because they updated stuff. I don't know what has been added necessarily to what we're playing, but... There's nothing funnier than making people kleptomaniac, music-hating narcoleptics and just dropping traps on them and, and watching them be angry. But we need to make sure that they don't come for us because we don't have much of an army at the moment. So we have to stay, be even more sneaky and passive-aggressive and just let, the, let it develop over time because I don't think I can build much. I can build a mana pit, actually, which is insanely good. Uh, and I can build a bio lab, which sounds awesome too so let's just start building stuff and corrupting this desert but everyone i think this is a good place to end this episode i want to say thank you so much for watching i hope you have an excellent evening or day and i will check you next time take care